Thorsten, I found a nice triplex in your favorite neighborhood. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey, folks. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search Analysis Show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, y'all, I'm your host, James Wise, and this is the show for my new uh, viewers out there, anybody who never seen this show before. This is the show where we work together one-on-one. -on -one. You get me, and then uh, after closing, you get my full team. Uh, you know, we have everything. We have property management. We have insurance. We have title, uh, maintenance, construction, the whole nine, right? We're helping you build real estate portfolios, start real estate portfolios, grow real estate portfolios. And the client I'm working with today is my dude, Thorsten. Thorsten, bro, you uh, you and me, we looked at a couple properties. Uh, this is another one that I think you're going to love, right? Um the first property we looked at, <clears throat> it was a C-class neighborhood, and originally you were like, yo, dude, uh, let's try some C neighborhoods. And uh, after that analysis and after you did some additional due diligence, which is very important, which is very smart out of you, you cruised the whole neighborhood on Google Earth, right? You checked everything out, and you were just like, yo, man, I don't know if I'm comfortable with this quality of housing stock, how the neighborhood looks, a little messy. Uh, you know, things are in a little bit of disrepair, so you weren't feeling in it and uh, I love that dude you told me you're like hey what about Cleveland Heights I cruised the neighborhoods of Cleveland Heights and I really like what I saw so after that you sent me another property that looked like a good deal but that neighborhood was similar you know more in line with that C stuff you don't like uh, than it is with Cleveland Heights so we nixed that deal as well and dude you should never do a deal uh, that you're not comfortable with man there's a lot of fish in the water so let's make sure we match you with the right property so that's why i found this one for you bro 3309 DeSoto avenue cleveland heights 44118 man you love cleveland heights it's a nice b-class neighborhood now they have not given us a lot of pictures to go off of just this one exterior photo this is a fully occupied triplex what the agent had said by the way this is uh listed by uh russell real estate very large income producing triplex recently painted exterior newer vinyl windows front porch replaced in 2019 new garage and uh, new garage doors installed and new entrance doors both first and second floors have two beds one bath kitchen living and dining rooms plus covered porch and parking spot in the garage third floor unit is one bedroom living room kitchen and bath looking for your first home to own occupy one of the units rent the other two with interest rates this low you're sure to cash flow and put something away for a rainy day well it wouldn't make no damn sense for people who are trying to live in one of the units to buy this because we got three tenants okay rents they're coming in hot dude 678 714 four and a quarter so this thing's bringing in 21 over 21 g's a year man now they have listed this about a week ago okay been on the market seven days they listed it at one hundred and twenty nine thousand dollars and i think uh you shouldn't really mess around dude i think you're gonna have to pay one hundred twenty nine thousand dollars if you want to buy this i think this uh it's not often you find nice neighborhoods properties with three tenants all paying pretty close to market rate i mean we're, we're close right like we could ideally we should probably be able to get the rents for the two bedroom units up to 750 and that one bedroom unit probably up to about five but i mean we're still bringing in some pretty decent cash flow right now so i think you're going to need to spend every bit of that 129.9 now they have not specifically said anything about the pos but at that price point we're going to negotiate to try to get you a clear pos report if you're watching and you're like, what in the hell is a POS, pause this show right now. Go to the show notes. I have a video that explains what POS is. Check that out. Going forward, I'm just going to assume you all know what I'm talking about. So I think we should have a clear POS. I don't think you need to worry about uh, doing any POS repairs for the price you'd be paying, which is $129.9. Plus, they talked about you know how much work they just did. So I think we got a professional landlord in there that could get the work done for us, right? So... If all that pencils out, bro, 1817 comes in, I anticipate 1,171 going out, leaving you with an NOI of 646 a month. Now, very important, though, 
This is an average, okay? This is an average. This is like taking several properties like this over the long term and breaking them down on their performance average. In real estate investing, guys, every single month is not going to be the same. We are dealing with an unlimited amount of variables. We are dealing with people, okay? I can't predict for you that one of the units or one of the tenants in these units doesn't die tomorrow and can't pay rent or doesn't beat his girlfriend or doesn't lose his job or this or that or this. There's a million variables that happen. So we can't project for you exactly how these properties are going to perform. We can only give you projections on like average performance in the short term, looking at one property over like six months. It can be anywhere. But we could mitigate our risks, though, right? We mitigate our risks by finding properties in nicer neighborhoods, by going to places like Cleveland Heights. Yeah, you're going to pay a little bit more for the property, but for guys like Thorsten, you'd prefer to pay more to deal with a lower amount of risks and variables. Can't prevent them, but we could reduce them, right? So keep that in mind. Now, as far as what it looks like, because, dude, you, you want to go ahead and finance this, right? Everybody knows quads are my favorite type of property, reason being... That is the most rental units you can get per one residential mortgage. Residential mortgages, you're capped at 10 of those suckers, guys. You can only get 10 residential mortgages. Then you got to go to commercial mortgages. When you're getting a residential mortgage, you get the best terms. 30 years, fixed interest, low interest, tax deductible interest, right? Four units is the most, one to four unit properties. So, you know, they're very, very rare though, right? We don't have a million quads in the, in the Cleveland market just on the market for you. So when one pops up, you got to get it. Well, I got you the next best thing here, bro. This is like a triplex, right? There ain't a lot of triplexes either. We got a crap ton of singles and we got a lot of duplexes. Triplexes and quads, a little bit more rare, right? So when you see one, you got pounce, bro. 129.9 is what you're going to pay. With uh, my average estimations of performance, dude, we're looking at a six cap. You get that beautiful residential financing. It's going to be an 8.8% cash on cash return, right? You only need 32 Gs to get into this deal. Now, this is more or less the type of performance you're going to see out of B-class neighborhoods. It's actually got a cash on cash return that might be slightly higher uh, than most because you'll see a lot of duplexes. So if this price point is something that scares you jumping from the C to the B, uh, just know that it's going to be built into the cake, bro. You get what you pay for. So uh, if you want those more sexy numbers, you know, we'd get into the, the lower quality neighborhoods, but you're not comfortable with that. So if I were you, I would err on the side of caution and pay a little bit more, get myself a safer investment, at least to get started, man. You know, no reason not to buy a few of these. Get your feet uh, wet, right? Get, get in the game, warm up a little bit. And then, you know, if after a few years of running, uh, you know, a very, very low risk portfolio, you know, you get the urge to try to go down to the C-class to try to chase those returns, we could do that. But I'd rather see you give up some projected return in exchange for a safer property than try to buy something you're not really comfortable with. So that's my thoughts on this one. One other thing, Thorsten, you were telling me that you are very much interested in doing burrs as well, right? You want to build a big portfolio, you want to do burrs. As you go up in quality of neighborhoods, it's very important you know this, bro. Like you, you want to target B neighborhoods, A neighborhoods. The nicer the neighborhood in a Cleveland market, two things. Number one, the lower the inventory is going to be a distressed real estate, right? Real estate gets distressed because the owners of the properties can't take care of them anymore. What's going to lead to that the most? Well, it's probably going to be tenants driving the landlords nuts and they realize they can't handle it. So we're going to see that in higher risk neighborhoods more often. So more inventory there for burrs. That's one. Number two, zoning. Okay. You take A neighborhoods, right? You want to do burrs, but you also want multifamily, bro. Well, they don't really put a lot of multifamily in A neighborhoods. We do see some of them in B neighborhoods. But the nicer the neighborhood, the rules of thumb should be for you. Fewer distressed properties, number one, and fewer multifamily properties on the market is number two. So... Uh, if you really look into to get into some more burrs and you want to stick to these nice neighborhoods, we're definitely going to want to open it up, target some singles. So probably on the next video I do for you, I'll probably uh, be on the lookout for some, you know, B or above burr deals that are going to be single family homes just because uh, that's going to give me a decent amount of inventory to, to comb through and to try to present to you and get your thoughts on it. So. That's all I've got for today's show, Thorsten. Let my team know what you want to do here. Everybody else, real quick, if you're like, hey, man, this seems pretty cool. I want to work with him like I'm working with, like he's working with Thorsten. Holdenwise.com. 
property search for sale tab, guys. Few ways you could work with my team, right? This, the Investment Properties for Sale show, it's another show we run. That's where we're selling properties to you. They come complete with video tours, right? We're all about providing transparency here at Holton Wise. That's our thing. So if you don't want your handheld, you don't need your handheld, you're an investor who's just ready to make bids, check out that show. Subscribe on the mailing list. We'll email it to you every day at 1 o'clock. Those are the properties we're selling. We can handle uh, property management after the fact. If you're a newer investor, though, you're, you really want uh, someone looking out for you and, uh, you know, going over the market with you and working together with you one on one, bouncing ideas back and forth, developing that relationship. You want to be here. You want to do what Thorsten's doing. This is the MLS search and analysis show. We got a bunch of packages. Thorsten's working off this 10 property package, which is what most of the clients, most of my clients do. Uh, but that uh, we have others, right? You could go down. You could do just one. We could, uh, you could hire my film team to go inside of any property you want and film it for you, et cetera, et cetera. So whatever you want there will work. And then lastly, guys, any of you guys out there who just want to comb through the market data, who want to see what's available and make offers, you know, maybe you guys make offers directly to the sellers. You don't even need me, right? You just want the data. Well, you can get my MLS access, my direct broker access is available to you guys for a very very low price and we pre-sort things for you so if you're looking for flips we got flips in there if you're looking for seller financing we got those in there if you're looking for rental properties and you're like thorsten and you want only b grade we got them sorted by b grade we also got them sorted by every other grade a c d f so whatever you want if you want it pre-sorted and sent to you every single day faster than Realtor.com, faster than Trulia, faster than any of those websites. This is direct from the MLS. The moment, a moment something hits the market or changes in price, you get a notification the same time brokers do. So if you want to be ahead of the game, ahead of all the other investors, that's what you want. And uh, if you want to go further into those properties, work with our team, you can. If not, you can work with the sellers, man. That's totally cool. It's the a la carte service we got here at Holton Wise, guys. That's it. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Based in Indianapolis, Indiana, FS Houses is the premier investment property brokerage with an in-house property management department that can take care of all those unwanted landlord headaches. FS Houses can offer you the complete turnkey solution as well as wholesale properties offered to you at a discounted rate. With a network of thousands of active investors, wholesalers, and brokers, FS Houses can help you sell your property for top dollar on the open market or in a hurry to motivated investors seeking distressed real estate. Visit fshouses.com or call 317-492-9025 for more information on the Indianapolis, Indiana real estate. Discount Property Warehouse, founded by real estate visionary Robert Feal, author of The Short-Term Retirement Program, is a complete turnkey solution for acquiring cash-flowing investment properties in Memphis, Tennessee. Our turnkey properties include a third-party home inspection, new HVAC with 10-year warranties, new dimensional roofs, competitive price-to-rent ratios, discounted property insurance, in-house property management, private financing, and much more. At Discount Property Warehouse, we have a staff of licensed agents standing by, ready to assist you with every aspect of the process. Call us today or visit us online at discountpropertywarehouse.com. U.S. Reeb is a full-service turnkey provider offering investors the opportunity to purchase single-family and multi-family investment properties in Cincinnati, Ohio, Dayton, Ohio, and Kansas City, Missouri. The purchase process is seamless, from reserving a property to obtaining financing, inspections, and insurance referrals. U.S. Reap has a dedicated team in place to manage the process from start to finish. In addition, U.S. Reap is also directly integrated with its own private placement fund for accredited investors, 
the fund seeks to raise $10 million to capitalize on the repositioning of distressed single-family and multifamily real estate. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.